The following program contains images of an actual surgical procedure that may be graphic and disturbing. Parents are advised that these images may not be suitable for young children. We all know domestic discord can escalate. In fact, every minute in the United States, 20 people are physically abused by an intimate partner. Last season, we met one of those victims in Brandy. Let's take a look back at her story. We were all trying to get him to leave. That's when he reached up and grabbed my shirt and he floored the car and took off. Dragging her 500 feet in front of me. I see my daughter running after me. I just fell to my knees, screaming and crying. He just floored it. He just started beating me as he's driving. All of a sudden, we hit a tree. He took me in the front of the car and he threw me on the ground. And he got on top of me and he just started banging my head on the concrete. I heard an ambulance. I guess Steve realized that he wasn't going to be able to kill me, so he tried to pull my eye out. He had ruined my whole entire life. It was the worst pain ever. Sorry. I just couldn't believe that somebody would do that to my mom. Obviously, the emotional scars, but you're also dealing with some physical ones. I open my eye, it's double vision, so I have to keep my eye closed. You know, I haven't been able to read because the muscle's been ripped. It's been constant. finger was gouging, it ripped the lower muscle to the lower part of your eye. We'd like to do an MRI scan to see what scarring is down there. We do have some great news for you. I think we have a chance of retrieving the muscle and restoring your normal vision to single binocular vision. And once your double vision has been improved, we can then focus on reconstructing your eyelid. She continued to struggle with scarring and double vision. So oculoplastic surgeon, Dr. Christopher Zumalon, and eye surgeons, Dr. Kenneth Wright and Dr. Boxer Walkler, they teamed up to help Brandy. So the skin graft is still a little bulky. What we're gonna do today is apply a microneedling technique to allow for it to continue to heal better. This is a needling pen that essentially has 12 little tiny needles that pulse at a high frequency rate to allow for the collagen to be inducted to allow for the scar tissue to improve. We're at about two millimeters right now. And as you can see, there's some capillary bleeding that's occurring, and this is exactly what you want. Microneedling has become more and more popular over the last decade because of its ability to be done in the office. Now I can go a little bit higher. I feel that I have broken up as much of that scar tissue as possible. You've accomplished a lot today. I think it was a lot emotionally to take in for her. It's pretty incredible. Hopefully she can put this all behind her. This is like real time adjustments. She's got no anesthesia and you're gonna adjust on the fly. Now the right eye is a little higher than the left. She shuts her eye to get rid of the double vision. The plan is to bring the eyes together very precisely so she's gonna be awake during the surgery. It's a sad case, it's horrible. And the psychological aspect of this is huge. I feel honestly a lot of pressure got to be precise. If you're off a little bit, you might as well be off a ton. If you feel any pain, let me know and I will stop. It's okay, huh? Just take a few breaths. Okay. Okay. You're going to feel a little pressure, so I'm going to grasp the muscle. So I just sutured into the eye wall. I'm going to pass another suture. Don't move. Beautiful. So now I'm going to secure the muscles. Oh, that hurt. It's pressure. I don't you feel know. pressure? Okay. Just take a deep breath. And you're going to feel a little pull, okay? Oh, okay. All right, count to three. Oh, 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 oh. Count to three. One, two, three. This side's too high. This one's too low. Now listen, I'm going to pull up a little bit. Oh, oh. Okay, you're going to feel tighten a little bit. Now I'm going to grab the muscle right there. Mm. You feel it? Yeah. Now see, I got it because I can tell the muscle, the whole eye moves, and oh, that's, I just don't have. Gosh, that hurts. All right, that's it. Ugh. You ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. And there's an X on the wall. 
You see double. 